What's going on guys? Welcome to fitnessinformant.com, Fitness Informant's YouTube channel. I'm Fitness Informant CEO Ryan Buckeye. Thanks for stopping by to check out 100% honest, no bullshit review of Pyrus Labs Halovar. This is a, what they're calling it is a natural test booster, supernatural results, male vitality rejuvenator. This is Halivar, interesting name, clever name, maybe? Depends, I'll let you decide that. Anyway, today we're gonna to talk about Halivar and a couple different things. First, we're gonna talk about the ingredient profile, what's used in this and what those intended purposes are, along with the dosages. We're gonna combine those together. Is this dose correctly? Then we're gonna talk about the effectiveness, and then fourth, we're gonna talk about the value of this product. So, first off, I wanna say this. This is a public service announcement. Before you run out and spend money on any testosterone-boosting product, get your blood levels checked to make sure you actually need a testosterone-boosting product. A lot of people will say, I need a test booster because it's going to put me in a huge anabolic state. Okay, this is not steroids, people. These test boosters are meant to maintain healthy levels of free testosterone, which means you need to be between anywhere between 300 and 1100. Uh, right around 800 is optimal where you're going to feel best in terms. And most of you people that are watching this video right now have no idea what your testosterone levels are. Go get your blood levels checked. Find out what your testosterone levels are because if they're drastically low, something like Halivar is not going to be for you. You're going to actually want to get on TRT or HRT, but if they're in the low normal range, maybe they're down in the 300s, 400s, something like Halivar could actually help increase that free range test back up to where it needs to be around 7, 800. So there's my public service announcement. Let's dive right into the ingredient profile. First ingredient, three grams of calcium HMB. Now, the reason why these tablets are so big and the reason why you got to take four of them is because this is three grams of calcium HMB per capsule. This is one capsule right here, people. You need to take four of these a serving. So those of you who don't like swallowing pills are going to hate this. Um, calcium HMB is an interesting ingredient because the studies on this ingredient are inconclusive. There was a study with trained athletes in which they were dosed three, four, and five grams per day of calcium HMB to see if this increased strength gains because that's what calcium HMB is supposed to do. In trained male athletes, they didn't see any significant results that indicated that there were increase in strength gains. Now, this study was also conducted with elderly women, 65 plus, in which calcium HMB did show significant increases in strength gains for those individuals. So, studies are inconclusive. I have those posted at the Fitness Informant right up on this entire, um, on, on this product. You can read those studies yourself. There's probably some other studies out there. So if you're a trained athlete like myself, this may not be beneficial for you, but maybe if you're not as trained or you're starting to get into it and your test levels are on that low, normal range, then this can help you increase those strength gains and, and testosterone production. Um, organic ashwagandha is KSM 66 at 600 milligrams. This is what you want to dose of that minimum to start boosting those free testosterone levels. There are studies that indicate that they do increase testosterone levels in libido in men. That study is posted at fitnessinformant.com as well. So that's a good dosage, a very solid dosage, and a good quality ashwagandha, which is uh, an ingredient that you should supplement with daily regardless if you're taking a test booster or not, in my personal opinion. Uh, last ingredient then is shilajat extract is Prima V at 200 milligrams. This is a good dosage of of Prima V, what this is doing is it actually increases your sexual functionality as a man. So part of the testosterone boosting function is obviously to get your testes to produce more testosterone, therefore your sperm production, your libido, everything should go up. Prima V, does, uh, Prima v, Prima v will help with that and help with sexual vitality, which will go hand in hand along with the test boosting capability. So two of the three ingredients used in this product uh, show to increase testosterone and help with male sexuality uh, vitality. But the third one, the calcium HMB, jury's kind of still out on that one. So it's really uh, up to you to do some more digging. I just, I haven't found enough of it now to say it's sufficient enough to include in a test booster. Also the fact that this is four capsules at that larger size is because of that that serving size. So overall, the ingredient profile, it's good, again, with question to calcium HMB. Is it needed? And this is also another reason why the price tag on this product is what's gonna be when we talk about value. So dosage, solid across the board. If calcium HMB is proved to be sufficient at three grams, they did studies at three, four, and five grams. So the doses there could be right. It depends on the type of person that you are. So keep that in mind. Send us a message, comment below if you have questions on that. I can try to help. But at the end of the day, rule number one, get your blood levels checked before you purchase any of this stuff uh, and go from there. In terms of effectiveness, now really to find out if a testosterone booster is effective, you want to get blood work before and after. Other ways you can tell is if you are drastically fatigued, you have, uh, you're, you're lacking libido, taking a test booster should increase those. So you should start to feel more energy and endurance. You should start to feel more libido. You should start to feel like you want uh, women or men, whatever your preference is, more and more taking this product. For me personally, um, 
a, a slight increase in fatigue or in, in energy levels. The ashwagandha does that, and I think it's a really good ingredient that does that. A slight increase in uh, libido, but nothing crazy spectacular. Um, typically, you're not going to find anything crazy spectacular. This isn't Viagra. This isn't this isn't testosterone, right? This is not steroids. This is not Viagra. I don't expect that type of reaction to this product, but you should see some slight increase in energy and some slight increase in libido, like I did. In terms of value, this is 30 servings. There's four tablets. You have 120 capsules in this. This retails for right around $69.95, 70 bucks. Uh, it depends on where you get it. Now that is a high price tag for this product, especially considering that I'm still out on calcium HMB. $70 for 30 servings. That's a lot. That's that's over $2 a serving. A lot of people are out there running around spending this type of money, 70 bucks on this, not knowing if they even need it. So this is why I'm saying get your blood levels checked. You can get your test levels checked for 70 bucks. That is a, a much rather a much better investment of $70, I think, than buying this right away. Now, nothing to discredit this. Is it worth 70 bucks? If calcium HMB comes out and there's more studies that provide uh, backup information on that, then I would say yes. But until that happens, I think $70 is a bit of a steep price tag for this product when there are other test boosters out there that do similar, that use similar ingredients like the ashwagandha, like the CJOT extract that you'll find in this product. So I would look elsewhere at this time until more studies come out on calcium HMB. If you are sold on this product, great, that's fine. We're not going to deter you from doing that. Check below, there may be a discount code to save you a few dollars on this to bring that $70 price tag down. Make sure you follow us on all of our social media channels. We're on Facebook, Instagram, Snapchat, and Twitter. Subscribe to our YouTube channel by clicking on the red subscribe now box here below. Stay up to date with all of our reviews right here on YouTube. Make sure you subscribe to our, to our podcast. It's called Be Informed, Live Fit, featuring eight-time Mr. Olympia, Ronnie Coleman, two-time Arnold Classic champion, Branch Warren, CEOs like Chris Gethin, Mark Loblar, PJ Braun, Aaron Singerman, and more. We're here on YouTube. YouTube, iTunes, Stitcher, Spotify, Podbean, and more. And for this full in-depth written review from Pierce Labs, Halivar, more reviews, and all fitness-related information, check us out online, fitnessinformant.com.